Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Geno's East of Chicago. This is the Tavern Style Thin Crust Meaty Legend Pizza. It was $7.99 at Jungle Gyms International Market. It is crumbled Italian sausage, pepperoni, Canadian bacon, Canadian bacon and bacon. Canadian bacon and ham. Canadian bacon and bacon? <laughs> Canadian bacon's just ham. It's just ham. Well, it's just hey ham then. I agree. Ham. Well, they say it's different, but it tastes like ham. Canadian bacon and bacon. <laughs> so look, it looks like, yeah, because the piece is on here. Yeah, so this is ham. Canadian bacon. And then there's bacon like that is bacon. So, what you I'm guessing it's cured differently. You probably, I'm sure. I'm sure there's some kind of difference. Uh, Canadians probably just call it ham. <laughs> um, but what you want to do is you want to preheat your oven to 400 degrees. You're going to put this on the center rack. Uh, don't cook the cardboard on the bottom, but keep it so that you can cut your pizza on it when it comes out. Um, it looks like everything is in a good spot so I don't need to move anything around. You're going to bake it for 15 to 20 minutes. I'm going to bake it for 20 minutes, the whole 20, and then we'll be back. So this is how the pizza looks after being in the oven 20 minutes. You will notice this is the only one uh, that I have actually used a cutting board. Even though I said earlier, use the piece of um, cardboard. It had, it was like wet. It, it had some wetness on it. So I decided it'd be best to throw that away and just use a cutting board. Kevin made the uh, observation, this looks like a pumpkin. This is uh, some cheese that melted in the oven, but it does, it's even flat on the bottom. It does uh, have a pumpkin shape. This says Chicago Classic since 1966. Uh, it's crispy, thin crust, fine ripened tomatoes, 100% mozzarella cheese, crumbled Italian sausage, Classic pepperoni, bacon plus Canadian bacon. Uh, GenosEast.com is their website. One sixth of a pizza, 128 grams, is 280 calories. So there's four meats. Yes. Sausage, pepperoni, ham, and bacon. Yes. Hmm. Um, and so some pieces, like you have one piece that, that has a little bit of maybe pepperoni, yeah, maybe, I don't know. Pepperoni. You had to. They, not all pieces have everything. I want a piece of that Canadian bacon. I know. I'm just going to eat a piece. <laughs> I know, it's kind of... Hmm. I like the Canadian bacon. Mm-hmm. It adds a little smokiness to it that you don't get in the rest of it. The bacon pieces are so tiny. Almost I, bacon bit size. I haven't gotten, uh, I haven't tasted any bacon. Thin. I get the Canadian bacon, it does have a smoky flavor to mm -hmm. it. It tastes like a smoky ham. Yeah. yeah. Um, this has probably been the most flavorful. And it has enough different toppings on it to where it spreads out pretty well. And then again, if you look at this piece. It has nothing, yeah. There's one piece of the Canadian bacon and there's one piece of sausage on it. And there might be a few pieces of bacon here and there. But for the most part, it's cheese, you know. But I think this helps balance out the sweet sauce a little bit. What I, after, after reviewing four of these. Mm -hmm. So if you've missed some of them, go back and watch them. What I have learned from Gino Z's is that they are um, skimpy when it comes to toppings. I said it. That's the truth. Well, they are. I, did, I don't get any bacon. I'm glad you got a few no, bacon bits. I saw a little pieces of it, but I, don't, I didn't taste that. No, I, I don't even get any at all bacon. So, for me, uh, that didn't work. Um, not it looks nothing like that picture. No, absolutely. <laughs> there is like literal bacon pieces all over that. You do not get that. that that's you not get about that. half the toppings of that. Yeah, it's just, and it, the thing is, is it would actually be a really decent pizza if they would put that much. Mm -hmm. I personally would not buy any of the four again. That's true. Because they don't have enough toppings. I agree. I, um, this one, out of the four we tried, we tried a cheese, a sausage, a sausage and pepperoni, and then this one last. Um, 
out of those four, this would be the one I would buy because it does have the most flavor. But the only reason it has more toppings is because there's more different types of toppings. So it, it's it's sparse, but it, at least there's enough different toppings spread around yes. where you can taste something different. But would I choose this pizza over another frozen pizza? Absolutely no. not. Now, we have only seen these at Jungle Gems. Yeah, um, we've never seen them local. International market. Um, my, our, I, I will speak for myself. My favorite frozen pizza is still the Motor City pizza. Oh yeah. Yeah, any day. Hands down. Yeah. Uh, ab above any frozen pizza, I would say no, my number one would be Motor City. If for some reason you cannot get a Motor City pizza in your area, I would get a Screaming Sicilian. Yeah. That That's would be my second choice. And I mean, because Screaming Sicilian's a really good pizza. Um, but Motor City is at the top of that list. And so I am not going to be choosing these over those just because they really, they skimp on their toppings. Yeah, and they, the other ones have so many more toppings. Yeah, and every single night when we finish doing these reviews, we are adding salt and pepper and stuff to give these more flavor because- Because yeah, their sauce doesn't have a lot of flavor. The sauce, it's it's just a plain, flat sauce. Tomatoes. Yeah, it hardly- It's tomatoes, literally. Yeah, it hardly has any flavor whatsoever. So you want a little something to taste, something different. Uh, so I will still add salt and pepper to this. I put nature seasoning on mine because I like that onion and garlic. Yeah. But yeah. Yeah, this difference. just doesn't have the flavor that Motor City and Scrum and Cecilia mm -hmm. has. No so, you know, you can try it if you want. I would save my eight bucks and buy something yeah, better. Yeah, because the other ones we mentioned are, are, eight are cheaper. <laughs> yeah, and they're cheaper pizzas. Yeah. Yes, absolutely. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.